I spent 166 days off the world. But somewhere along the way, my perceptions of the world shifted. When you're on board a spaceship, you're very much aware of the passage of time. The clock is running, your heart is beating, your wristwatch is going around, you're trying to stay on schedule, and you have so many things to do. But sometimes, you are able to take a little time to relax and actually notice what's happening. Notice the magic of weightlessness. Sometimes you have the chance to look out the window and see the world. You're going so blisteringly fast 17,000 miles an hour, five miles every second. And you start then going around the world 16 times a day. 16 sunrises, 16 sunsets a day. But what it does to your body clock, it, it's, it's strange. Your, your body doesn't know what time it is. There's no natural way to tell whether it's day or night. And you start somehow, somewhere along the way, your perception shifts from your wristwatch to the weather, to the seasons, to the eternity that is the Earth itself. You start to, for the first time in your life, get a sense of what a billion years might be. Four and a half billion years of history patiently, silently, almost eternally floating next to you. I took a look at the planet and just let it sort of sink in. And then I thought to myself, this is something that human eyes are not supposed to see. This must be the view from heaven. I could feel the tears welling up and going down my face. And I turned my head thinking, I can't, you know, it's, it's too beautiful for me to look at. I was looking into a paradise in our planet Earth. When I looked at the Earth from space and I saw that thin, shimmering blue layer of light that is our atmosphere, I was struck by one thing. The Earth is an incredible planet, but we don't live outside of this web of life. We're intricately connected to it. It's like it's, it's our own personal spaceship flying through space as this one place where we all live. This planet that takes care of us. Seeing the world for what it truly is, home.